Hello students, today our topic is volume strength. Before to discuss the volume strength, what is the terminology and concepts required for the volume strength? We are concentrating on these two points. The first terminology required for knowing the volume strength, what is called volume and what are the reactions involved in the calculation of the volume strength. Volume is an, a concentration term. Volume is an, a concentration term like molarity, normality, like that. But it is very particular for the sulfuric acid, especially for expressing the concentration of the SO3 in the volume. To know the things, first student have to know what is called volume. Students, H2, SO4, and SO3 combination of these two just you have to add the atoms two hydrogens two sulfurs and seven oxygens this H2S2O7 is called volume is called volume this is commonly called pyrosulfuric acid pyrosulfuric acid this is called also called fuming sulfuric acid fuming sulfuric acid this is the basic data required right what is called volume strength terminology volume now the students knows the what is called volume. What is called volume strength? Generally H2S2O2, H2S2O7 is a combination of sulfuric acid and SO3. What percentage of SO3 is there in volume or in the pyrosulfuric acid is expressed in terms of the volume strength. Generally if you are taken a sample of volume on that sample 118 percent labeled volume is the data is available or sometimes it is 103 percent labeled volume right so this is the way to express the percentage of SO3 present in the given sample of volume right what is called 118 percent labeled volume what is called 103 percent labeled volume to know the things to know the things student have to learn what is volume strength before to discuss the volume strength students have to understand this equation here SO3 is there it is present in the sulfuric acid when water is added to the sulfuric acid containing SO3 or volume this SO3 part of the volume will react with the H2O and form the sulfuric acid. Here SO3 molecular weight is 80 and H2O molecular weight is 18. Both will react and form 98 grams of sulfuric acid. These two concepts are required. What is called volume? Now the students are known a combination of H2SO4 and SO3. When water is added, SO3 will react with water and form sulfuric acid. That means final reaction is H2S2O7 when mixed with the water, 2 moles of sulfuric acid is formed. Real part is only SO3 will react with the water. Real part of the reaction is only SO3 will react with the water but not the volume. So the central reaction here is SO3 reacts with water and forms sulfuric acid. This is the basic data required. I am simply recalling H2S2O7 is called volume. It is composed of SO3 and H2SO4. To know the percentage of SO3 in the volume we are using a concentration term called volume strength. 
to calculate the volume strength every student must know a central reaction that is 80 grams of SO3 will react with 18 grams of water and form 98 grams of sulfuric acid that is the central reaction right what is volume strength now the concentration term which expresses the percentage of the SO3 in the volume is called as volume strength now how to calculate and what is the significance of the volume strength I am taking an example of wait student I will take an paper yes here I am taking an example 118% labeled volume I am taking this much, this sample, right? 118% labeled volume. What is called 118% labeled volume? Very simple students, 100 grams of, 100 grams of volume will reox with 18 grams of water, water to produce 118 grams of H2SO4. This is the meaning of 118% labeled volume. I am repeating 100 grams of this labeled, this labeled volume, every 100 grams of this labeled volume will react with 18 grams of water and produce 118 grams of H2SO4. 118 grams of H2SO4. Students, here technique and shortcut is also available. 118% of labeled volume means 118 minus 100. That means 18 grams of water will react with the 100 grams of volume. Here 18 grams of water if it reacts as per our previous knowledge SO3 when reacts with the H2O H2SO4 is formed here how many grams of water 18 grams as per the balanced equation 80 grams of SO3 is required so here 18 grams involved means how many grams of SO3 is there 80 grams. So, the given sample of volume contains 80 grams of SO3 and 20 grams of sulfuric acid. So, percentage of SO3 is in the given 118% labeled volume is equal to 80%. Percentage of SO3 in 118% labeled volume is 80%. I hope you understand. I will take one more example. Before to discuss another example, I want to repeat. What is called 118% labeled volume? Very simple. 118% labeled volume means 100 gram of volume will react with 18 gram of water and yield 118 gram of sulfuric acid. Just this 118 is divided into 100 grams of the volume and 18 grams of the water. This is the central reaction involved in the uh, determination of the volume strength. As per this equation, 18 grams of water will react with 80 grams of SO3. That indicates based on the quantity of water used, the percent weight of SO3 is determined. This is present in the 100 grams, so simply it is 80%. I will, I will take one more example. 104.5% labeled volume. 104.5% labeled volume. What is called 104.5% labeled volume? Very simple. 100 grams of 100 grams of volume will react with 
फोर पॉइंट फाइव ग्राम्स ऑफ वाटर फोर पॉइंट फाइव ग्राम्स ऑफ वाटर एंड यील्ड वन नॉट फोर पॉइंट फाइव ग्राम्स ऑफ वोलियम सॉरी सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड वॉट इज द परसेंटेज ऑफ एस फो थ्री प्रजेंट इन दिस लेबल्ड वोलियम वेरी सिंपल टू कैलकुलेट एज पर अवर बेसिक इक्वेशन एस फो थ्री प्लस एच टू एस फो फोर गिवस एच टू एस फो फोर एस फो थ्री मीन्स एटी ग्राम्स एच टू ओ मीन्स एटीन ग्राम्स बट ही फोर पॉइंट फाइव ग्राम्स ऑफ एच टू ओ इज टेकन देन वॉट वेट ऑफ एस फो थ्री इज देर ऑन सिंप्लीफिकेशन क्वेश्चन मार्क इज इक्वल एटी इन टू फोर पॉइंट फाइव बाई एटीन ऑन सिंप्लीफिकेशन इट विल बी फोर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी ग्राम्स ऑफ एस फो थ्री इज देर इफ ट्वेंटी ग्राम्स ऑफ एस फो थ्री इज देर इन द गिवन लेबल्ड वॉल्यूम दैट इंडिकेट्स ट्वेंटी परसेंट ऑफ एस फो थ्री इज देर दिस इज द वे टू कैलकुलेट परसेंटेज ऑफ एस फो थ्री इन द वॉल्यूम राइट आई विल आई विल गिव वन मोर एग्जाम्पल फॉर बेटर अंडरस्टैंडिंग checking 106% labeled volume 106% labeled volume what is the meaning of this one 100 grams of volume will react with 6 grams of water and yield 106 grams of sulfuric acid right simply the central reaction so3 plus h2o gives h2so4 as per the balanced equation one mole of so3 means 80 one mole of water is 18 18 grams of h2o will react with 80 grams of so3 but here we are taken only 6 grams this 6 grams will react with how many grams of so3 on simplification 80 into 6 by 18 that is equal to 3 80 by 3 that is equal to 26.67 something percentage 67 grams this is present in the 100 grams of volume so therefore percentage of so3 in volume is equal to 26.67 right Thank you students this is all about volume strength please subscribe my videos and share my videos like my videos thank you for watching